When y'all was in that box, y'all calling me beggar, calling me bum, calling me broke. Did I did I get mad at y'all? Because I don't know if y'all might one day, if y'all watching me because y'all fuck with me, but y'all just don't like the beggar part. Y'all probably like my content, but then as soon as I say, okay, y'all, because y'all sister beans or a cash shop, y'all probably just don't like that part of me. But at the end of the day, y'all probably fuck with all of my content. I'm not going to kick y'all out of here because y'all might grow to love me, G, because y'all going to know I'm not a beggar. I don't be on here begging every single fucking day. For the past couple of days, though, this month, though, I have because I knew my daughter's birthday was coming up. I'm not going to lie. I knew it was coming up. I just didn't say that until it got to the end. Because I didn't want to be like, this for my daughter's birthday just every day. So I just like, if y'all care, y'all, please send me a CA, y'all. I've been doing that. I ain't going to lie this month only, though. That's like every, damn near almost every day. Only because it's my child's birthday, G. So don't 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 do me like that, y'all. Like for real, don't don't let these hating ass hoes that want to do the same thing. I literally in the pocket want to go there. I could play the screen recorder. Her talking about she want to beg for cash apps. Oh my mama, cause I I felt like she was recording me. I felt like she was recording me. That's why I recorded that bitch. Girl, I got your motherfucking ass asking for talking about you go go live asking. She, she was like, Ivy, I ain't gonna lie to you, girl. I think I'm gonna um I'm gonna drop y'all off at the house and I'm gonna go get some chicken. But then I think I'm gonna go home and I'm asking some cash apps. Oh yeah, and let me speak on this. Let me mother oh yeah, my daughter told me to send her the damn money. Let me motherfucking speak on this. She don't know she's taking more and more money away from her shit. I I shouldn't even have to pay for this. I shouldn't even have to pay for her. That's all the evidence you need. Oh, that's Weezy telling me. Okay. But anyway, so hold on. Keeping up with A1. Keeping up with A1. Hold on, y'all. I got the motherfucking big one when I come back, y'all. Come on, y'all. We only need one more head to be to the fifth star. I'm going to send the girl this money. Y'all, let me know. Let me know, y'all. Let me know if I'm lagging, too, y'all. Let me know if I'm lagging. My phone moving so fucking slow. I ain't never... Thank y'all so much. I see them at the fifth star. Uh, my phone moving so slow. Let me know if... Because even... What's up, Maj? What up? Let me know if I'm uh freezing or anything, y'all. All right, so... I'm lagging. All right, let me switch phones. I'm going to switch phones. Because it's always this phone. It's always this phone. Let me switch phones real quick, y'all. Thank you, Ma. I appreciate it. <coughs> I wasn't crying because of you. Okay, girl. Just leave me alone, girl. That's what happens when they get everything they want, but she gonna be back crying when she see she ain't gonna be able to get this room. Because I just gave her $150 out of her room money. <laughs> yep, sure did. She'll be alright. Look at her. I was in my feelings because... She's talking about they show court's favoritism. Alright. All right, y'all, I'm, I'm back on the good phone. Hopefully, I ain't lagging no more. Let me know. Last year on, on the first. That's my daughter. She texting me and texting me and texting me. Well, you got to think about it. They, of course, they're going to show favoritism because they bullshit ass niggas. Oh, fuck your daddy, girl. Girl, your daddy probably so drunk and high and stupid that he don't even know it's your fucking birthday. Oh, my brother. Hold on, y'all. Damn, yeah, should I tell okay? Hold 
I'm gonna say Bob for my baby. All right, y'all, let me send this damn girl this money. I'm sending the girl that's doing my daughter had the money. All right, y'all, so boom. So Punky go go live, right? Hold on. What the fuck is this? <laughs> hey. Ooh, she, when she, she, if she on 87, she got my card. She had asked me to, uh, ask me to, I guess because she can't use her card. So she oh, can't use her. I don't know what to tell you. No, I'm saying I, can... I don't know what to tell you. She on 87, nigga, she gone. What the fuck? She gone, nigga, bye. She got my face. That shit just pissed me off. No, but you know, they don't do it like that out here. Some, you know, Chicago motherfuckers will rob your ass and get their hair done and leave. So you gotta, you gotta pay for your efforts. As soon as you sit down in that chair, you gotta pay out here in Chicago. But anyway, so Parker ass, right? She gonna try to go live and tell y'all and cut up her debit card, her her, her Apple Pay card, her, uh uh, Cash App card because when she dropped me off, I sent her money. Hello, let me show y'all. What's her name? Shaboy again? What the fuck is her name? How you spell Parker name, y'all? How you spell her motherfucking name? How y'all spell her fucking name? Oh, here you go. How do we look at transactions? Okay. Okay, right? Y'all see how I got two transactions. I said her five dollars one day when she was begging for cash apps, and I said fuck the haters, and then. I had sent her uh, thirty dollars. I had sent her thirty dollars so I could pull it off. I sent her thirty dollars so I could put off twenty dollars. You know why? Because she told me that her card takes ten dollars automatically off. So I sent her thirty dollars, and I know they gonna charge me like two dollars at the ATM. So I started her thirty dollars to take money off her card. I took the money off, gave her a card right back. She gonna say I'm trying to <clears throat> scam her. And shit like that. Bitch, you ain't have no money in your cash up. I'm a scam you zero dollar having ass bitch. I don't give a fuck about you canceling no card, girl. Nobody gonna think to scam you, bitch. I don't think about it. I don't even do shit like that. And the only thing about a bitch, I did believe her. Yes, I did. I did believe her. But at the end of the day, it don't matter. Because I know she was lying. Because when I sent her the money, she showed me the money in her account. And it said $29. Because I guess she was in the negative. It showed me $29. I said the 30, but it said 29. I pulled off my 20 and let that bitch keep the change. That bitch has zero dollars of cash apps. I know that be popping that up. And that's what be killing me. Don't y'all be saying when I be lying to her and she be like, Ivy, so what's this? What's the problem? And I be like, nothing. They over here telling me that you said we want the bam and that we want the bam. She said, and you believe them? And I said, what the fuck do you mean? Did I believe them, bitch? If you say you done said, then no, I don't believe them. But then she turned around, oh, Ivy said this. Oh, I knew Ivy was that. Oh, Ivy said that. Oh, I knew Ivy was this. Bitch, you know damn well when I go live, I don't talk about you, bitch. I am my own content, bitch. I don't talk about you. I don't give a fuck about none of you bitches that be having something bad to say about me. I don't give a fuck about y'all. And to be honest with y'all, I don't be wanting to even bring y'all hoes up on my live. Because I don't want y'all to be like, oh, oh, she got views because of me. She got content coming from me. She getting this. No, bitch. All of these views that's here, they've been here since this morning when I was talking to my baby daddy. When I fucking leaked his motherfucking news, bitch. Hey, Miss Janice. Hey, beautiful. They killed BLM. Who is BLM? Who is BLM? Is you talking about Martin Luther King? Oh, that's LMK. LMLK. Hello. Pumpkin don't know how to treat people. That's why she has no friends. 
the horse. Punk and Mad Ivy, she don't got us no more to help with the shoot show. Oh, Mookie, period, y'all. Black Lives Matter. Black Lives Matter. Who killed him? Who killed him? Who is Black Lives Matter? That's a horse? What is y'all talking about? Who is BLM? The movement. Okay, Ivy. It's the horse. BLM is Black Lives Matter horse, and the horse. they took that horse to a white veterinarian, and they killed the horse. Mm -hmm. The horse name was Black Lives Matter, and it was a black horse. They killed that horse on purpose. Yeah. Fuck white people. Yeah. No, I wouldn't say fuck white people because all the white people didn't do it. You know. I'm gonna drop y'all. I know you're probably trying to get down. But damn, that's crazy. The horse meant so much to the black community. Never heard of this. Me neither, y'all. Well, I'll take it to a white vet if that's the case. I mean, how many black vets do y'all know, though? What the horse got to do with the black people? That man in Chicago with the horse. Okay, y'all. The, the rest of the piece, horse. I mean, because at this point, I don't know what's going on. Um, but you know, people die every day, B. Um, they began racist. Was the horse black? <laughs> Y'all, please leave me alone about this damn horse. I don't even know what's going on. I'm gonna have to look it up, y'all. Yeah, that's the animal. Still got a rest of peace. It was a black horse. Okay, y'all, it's too much. It's too much. All right, so anyways, so punk and ugly ass go motherfucking sit up here and cut her card up on line like a dumbass bitch she is. And she cut the card up anyway because the bitch ain't got no fucking money. Bitch, your card was all zero negative because when I put $30, I sent you, it had 29 And I went and pulled my motherfucking money off. All you had to do was change the pick code, bitch. And don't nobody, I don't even remember your pick code. I don't give a fuck about your pick code. I don't give a fuck about that. I done sent plenty of people to the store with my cars, and I didn't even change the pen. I didn't even change the car. I don't give a fuck. I trust people. You want to sit up here and act all like this and like that, bitch. I should not trust you, and I feel like you tried to set me up because the girls tried to jump me in that house. I feel like you tried to set me up to get pew pewed because motherfuckers had a gun, and I told you why you didn't check the bitches for the pew pews. She said, no, nah, I got security guards. Bitch, what the fuck the security guards going to do? And then you lied because the security guards never fucking came. Then, outside of that, the bitch kept on talking some, ooh, you want to see, see your brains outside your head? Why the fuck she kept saying that? I think that she, 20, I think that Pumpkin did this whole thing to make it look like we had something going on. So if I would have got Pium Pium in the house, she would have tried to make it seem like it was an accidental shooting or something. She would have made it like it was accidental. That's how my cousin got set up. That's how they do it out here in Chicago. Right, the girl came with a pew pew. They tried to jump me. The hoes tried to jump me. The hoes tried to jump me. The, what happened was, it was one drunk bitch, I will follow her and she inboxed me, this is her. I don't want y'all to go following her. Don't go following this bitch. I'm going to just go to one of her pictures. Because she just inboxed me after I unfollowed her. She inboxed me. And she said, no hard feelings. I wasn't going to fight you. Y'all see the date on it. But anyways, I'm going to show y'all a picture of her. It say follow back. So I guess she following me. This lady got drunk every day. This is the lady I told y'all. She the one who had the pew pew. 
She brought all her motherfucking cousins in the motherfucking house. She brought all her motherfucking... What was that? What you need to know about monkeypox? See, I have these pictures I can't show y'all because she have naked. <coughs> but she wore clothes. She only changed her clothes twice. Yeah, most of these show her titties. Hold on. Yeah, it ain't really a lot of pictures of her. This outfit, oh baby, she wore this outfit three times, girl. She wore this outfit three times, girl. She wore that outfit three times, girl. When she wore it the first day, and then she changed clothes, and then the next day she put it back on. Why was they even thinking to fight you? Okay, so this is what happened. So, me and the girl was roasting each other. Remember I told y'all we had freestyle battles, and then we started roasting each other, me and her. It was like mostly like only me, her, Pucky, and one other girl there. The other bitches didn't show up until like later on that night. And then the next day, the rest of the girls showed up. Like two more of the other girls. Two girls didn't show up at all. Uh, but anyway, um, me and her was roasting each other. And then she kept saying, oh, I love you, bitch. I love you. I'm going. Kept kissing me on my cheek. And I told Pucky if I break out on my face, I'm suing that bitch. Because why is this bitch kissing me? She kept kissing me on my cheek, telling me somebody was pretty. Her and her cousin. She brought her cousin the next day. Her cousin said, damn, it's something about you. You just look so fucking sexy. Like, I don't know. It was something about them girls. They kept telling me I was fine and looked good and, and stuff like that. And I'm going to show y'all the date. The date. This is what I had on the date. This is what I had on the date. I'm not saying whatever, whatever. But this is how I looked at the day. The, 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 they, they kept flirting with me. This is what I had on. They kept on flirting with me. And um, hold on, I'm gonna give y'all a close up picture. They just kept saying I was fine. Hold on. They kept on saying low battery. They kept on saying I was fine and shit like that. And I, I really just tossed the wig on. You know, I had this in my head. You know, my real hair, like, and I wore a bun and I had my little edges together on some of the videos. And then I went and put my wig on. So any motherfucker way. Um, and then, you know, I, I looked like this on a couple of days. Like, these are all my outfits I wore. Trying to get a good picture because I looked at a hot ass mess. This is how I looked at it. You know, I had my little outfits together. And then, this is what I looked like my first little couple of days. Y'all see, this was the Airbnb. Nah, this was the Wayne Stop. This was the Wayne Stop out of Airbnb. But anyway, so... We was sitting there uh, drinking this shit, right? And me and the girl that I just showed y'all a picture of, we used to, we, we was the closest in the house because we was the uh, first two there. And um, so, when we had, when we was drinking and stuff like that, that's what, um, when we was drinking and stuff like that, that's what, uh, she started getting drunk and you could tell she was drunk and she started being all over the place, kept kissing me and stuff, talking about, oh, you're sexy, you're so beautiful, blah, blah, blah. So, right after that, hey, Bonnie, Bonnie, is Chaz still here? Chaz still here? Yeah. Ask him, do he have his cash out card? Uh, Fuck his ugly ass. Yeah, y'all was sitting next to each other awaiting the food for pockets. So you saw that. And I think I showed her. I showed her on the camera. But anyway, let me get to her after this girl. Hold on. So what's it a storyline when she say you got all your clothes? From five and below. She, I, I, I don't, he got it. So use it. Alright, what all you need me to get? I'm, I'm gonna tell you, cause she, uh, Chantel, hold on, Chantel text me. She Oh, yeah, 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 but don't, you know, cause she, she says she don't need all of it. Here, take this downstairs too. I just don't want to put a business out there. Okay, so I just finished cleaning that whole kitchen. Bro. Oh, you wash the dishes? Yeah. Period, bro. It's say like, I'm feeling that hair color on you. Thank you. And this dye is it's going, you know, I got to do some shit because it looks like my hair growing. You see that? Where it's getting black? I got to refresh it. But anyway, so anyways, y'all. So anyways, so we was drinking. You you saw a fucking too. She was sitting right next to me. No, it wasn't. I mean, y'all know I don't shop at Five and Blow. What the fuck? But if, but if you did, what the fuck does it matter? Like, That's what I'm saying. Like, 
Like, <laughs> with that shit. Like, always trying to question where somebody fucking is shopping. Y'all hoes be paying $300, $400, $500 for fucking outfits, and y'all still be looking a fucking mess. But like, what I'm talking about, you can go to Walmart, do they like, but it don't clothes? fucking matter. Do they sell clothes to fucking They sell, like, pajamas and shit. Um, didn't you just lie about having cancer? Uh-uh, kick her. Don't 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 get somebody bitch, I didn't lie about, about a motherfucking thing. Shit. And you real fucking invested, bitch. And don't worry about what the fuck I got going on. Because everybody knows that you're a psycho bitch. You don't get it. You be like, I'm going to hold that your kids don't get it. Bitch, you better hope your mama don't fucking get it. Bitch, you better hope your daddy don't fucking get it. You don't get it. You better hope your mama don't fucking get it, bitch. You better hope your dog and your cat don't fucking get it, bitch. Can't even hear shit with that fucking government ass fucking phone. But anyways, fuck all that. Fuck the hell freeze, because bitches is weird. Uh, but what I was going to say, you said they sell pajamas and shit at Five and Below. First of all, let's go ahead and be real. Guess where I got my clothes from? I got majority of my clothes from motherfucking City Trends and other clothes from Berlin to Co. Factory. Why the fuck, when we went to City Trends, she bought that Black Queen outfit now. Do y'all remember that Black Queen outfit? It was a black, red, black, and white. Like, it was the color of the African flag. Her whole outfit was the color of the African flag, and it had Black Queen all over it. Now she picked it up and she said, Oh, I should get this because you know Queens of Chirac Black Queen. So she bought that right and she didn't buy nothing else. So she said, you know what? I'm gonna just get this and I'm gonna get my other clothes from somewhere else. Why the fuck the day we went to the Airbnb she had on this purple jumpsuit? Purple jumpsuit, okay? Why the fuck she wore that? Then she changed it to the black queen outfit after she got her makeup done. We did a couple of scenes, okay? Cameraman got that when she he was doing the makeup, so she got a couple of makeup shots and a couple of outfits in it. So then, why the fuck she ended up going to bed, left that morning, had the purple jumpsuit back on. Put the purple jumpsuit back on. She went home, and that's when she was gone, and that's when we first started beefing. So why the fuck, when she came back later on that day, about 7 o'clock p.m., because she didn't want to feed them hoes, I didn't say it mattered. I don't care that she got, I got my outfit for City Trends too. I'm not talking shit. But while she trying to talk about somebody, bitch, you got your clothes for City Trends, $7 outfit ass bitch. So anyway, so when we left, when she came back, she uh, went in there to the, in the room to uh, go do some shit. So I told her, I was like, fuck it, somebody in the bathroom, can I use your bathroom? She said, yes, her suitcase was open. She had that purple jumpsuit on that she had on yesterday and that black queen outfit in her suitcase. That's it. Uh I feel like this. People buy what they could afford. People wear what they could afford. Some people wear things more than once because that that's probably something that makes them feel good when they put it on. That's just how I feel about it. You know what I'm saying? So you may some people you may see some people who wear certain outfits more than once, more than twice, more than three times because you never know how that outfit makes them feel. They probably got that one compliment in that outfit, so they're gonna continue to wear it because They've never gotten compliments or nothing else that they had going, you know, have on. You're just, I just look at things totally different. Some people going to wear what they can according to what, and that might be the outfit that make her feel good. That might be the outfit making her like you that know, ugly ass colorful. Person. No, I'm I got like this. that ugly ass colorful shirt that we don't fucking like, bitch, that you be wearing. We hate that colorful shirt you got. You got this for the comment. Stop letting these people make out feel like they rich or whatever the fuck. Furthermore, uh, Punk look like she shop at Party City and at the uh, thrift store. So, yeah, ain't nothing wrong with If you were to shop at Five and Below, see the trick, wherever the fuck you shop at, what the fuck is wrong with it? These That's comments the thing. That's the thing. Okay. I don't care. Okay. Like, if I did shop at City Trees, that's fine. But the thing that I don't like is don't lie. Don't lie on me, though. You get what I'm saying? Don't fucking lie on me. Call my 773 number. Don't fucking lie. I think my son got it. Call my 773 number. He keep coming up and stealing shit. I'm trying to finish the story. I'm where what they want. Right. Well, finish it. No, I'm saying the people that... You got my phone? Give me my phone. I'm going to drop... Well, you could drop me down because I'm eating so you could finish your story. Hello? What's up, Missy? No. Her phone tweaking. Her phone tweaking. Are right, you always come back up, Pucky? 
A lot of designer shit ugly as fuck. That's what I said. Oh, girl. Hey, China. What's up, uh, Kiki? I got the headphones. I don't know if you was in here, girl. I got them. And thank you so much. They lit as fuck. Period. Hold on. I ain't even use them yet. Why they at 99%? They was at 100% at first. Anyway, why don't I go ahead on now? All right, y'all. So, anyway, so we was drinking and shit like that, right? So, when we was drinking, we was getting drunk. We was talking to each other. We was laughing. Woo -woo. And then the girl was waiting on the food and stuff like that. Y'all remember? Because fuck you two just said it. Y'all remember I was laughing. I showed some of the girls. But the girl that I showed y'all, the one I was like, damn, look at her. That was the one girl that I really did not, you know, get jiggy with. So, anyway, all I know... One girl brought a friend. The friend just so happened to be the bitch that did not want to sign the WNBA. So, being that she didn't want to sign it, Punky went crazy when the girl came in the house and started getting paperwork. Out like, uh-uh, you got to sign the WNBA. You got to sign the WNBA. Everybody, everybody, did you sign it? Matter of fact, you got to sign yours too. And she was just walking through the house going crazy with the WA because she felt like the girl wanted to fuck the cameraman, which is who she was fucking. 20, uh, who she was fucking. Okay? So... She actually just left the house after she passed out the NWAs. She left the house. And then when she did that, that's when she called the girl. The other girls were sitting up there with me. She called the girl and told her that she got to tell her friend to leave. So when she told the girl to leave, the girl was like, I don't know why she wanted to leave. I signed the NWA. And I was like, I don't know why she wants to leave either. I said, I said, damn, oh, is you the girl that uh, got the uh, cameraman number? I would just put two and two together. She was like, yeah. I was like, hmm, that's probably why she wants you to leave. I swear to God, I said it just like that. I'm like, shit, we being messy. Let's be messy. I said, hmm. I said, girl, she probably that's probably why she wants you to leave. Cause you know that's that's her nigga. She was like, she gave me that look, and she was like, well, I better tell. So anyway, long story short, she asked the girl to tell her friend to leave. So both of them left. She said, bitch, if my friend can't be here, bitch, I'm gone too. If I can't be here, gone too. So both of them left, right? No plus ones. Sweetie pie, I don't know what's. But anyway, so all here, Bonnie. Yo, hey, Bonnie. Bonnie. Bonnie! He must have left. Anyway, so, no plus ones. So, one of the dumbass bitches, one of the dumbass bitches, one of the dumbass bitches, um, the girl I'm talking about that I just showed y'all a picture of, she um said, is it okay if my cousin come up here? She don't mind serving the, the NWA. She don't mind this and that. Ew, now Puckin is one person on Beagle. I actually believe don't get dick. No, nah, she actually fucked the cameraman. She fucked him. And I don't know if it's because she ain't have enough money to pay him, but she fucked him. She did. But he didn't admit it, though. She said it. But why would she say it? She said it. Anyway, so, so the girls asked, the girl, the, the, the other two girls left. So the girl that tried to jump me, she asked her cousin, because she said she's real professional and she's supposed to be doing a music video. The cameraman is her cousin as well. So she already got a cameraman up there, but the cameraman is the cameraman, so he don't count. But she brought her other female cousin up there. Now, I'm not going to lie. She was cute. I'm not going to lie. A nice little physique going on. She was cute now, look. Hello? Yes, ma. Hello. Hey. Yeah, I got a question. Is that? We over here, all eight seven batteries, jewelry. Is it uh like a shark or something over here? Where I can give me some Yeah, yeah you yeah, you gotta go to us, K Drive. No, I'm over here like where we at. No, no, no. Um, if you want to get some chicken though, Harold's right there. That's it. No, I didn't say chicken. I want chicken for it. Oh, they got docks right there. They got a docks right there. All uh, right, let me let me try to. Buy yeah, do yeah, docks is right there by uh on the side on the across the street, not by Jewel though. It's across the street by Wingstop. All right. All right. Huh? Yes, ma'am. Hey, Abby. How are hey. you? Hey, y'all. 
What's hey, up, like, right? Look, I just want to. Can I say something real quick? Huh? I, don't, I don't. I don't get a lot of people on this app. I for one, I don't see nothing wrong with shopping at five, five and below. I get some t-shirts from now. Hell, I shop at the thrift store. It's That's how you know that she is lying. First of all, and second of all, she shopped at City Trends. Like, girl, you are not an expensive you bitch. You get your wigs off Amazon. Wait. Girl, shut up. Understand. And ain't nothing wrong with that either. But I'm just saying she it's like not. Did. That's what I said. She acting like she this uppity ass bitch by lying on me about five and below. I don't give a fuck. Like, I actually, now I want to know where five and below is that bitch. Like, I want to know. Nothing wrong. What are you talking Even about? The thrift stores. Let me tell you something. I go to work. You will never imagine me going to work. Yeah, I go to work and sometimes my outfits from the shirt to the pants be $4. And I and I dress half of better than people at, at, at my job. But the, but the thing is, people live among their means. Some people fake it to make it. It ain't nothing wrong with going and shopping anywhere that you you find stuff cute at. Just like for, for see, instance, they keep saying they person. don't sell clothes. Everybody saying they don't sell clothes. They do. They sell shirts. They do. They sell shirts. They sell shorts. Cause I didn't buy shirts out of there. Ain't nothing wrong with five dollars and below. And, and if anybody right, clothes. and if anybody was in here, I showed y'all all my clothes. All of my clothes were outfits. All of my clothes were three pieces. That. Let me tell you something. I like nice things. I do, but I know how to shop on a budget. Hell, I go to the pawn shop. Some people like to go pawn their Louis Vuitton purse. Hell, I like it when they go and drop their shit out so I can go buy it for a little or nothing. It's nothing wrong with shopping on the budget. It's nothing wrong with going different places to get things. No, y'all, this price. happened from when I had the crochets in my head, y'all. This happened So from at the, the end of the day, I just look at it like some people on here faking. They act like they uppity. They got money out the ass and they got a pot to piss in. You, at the end of the day, you just got to keep doing you. And what works for you works for you. And keep letting people spend their money so you can go rebuy it and buy it for the low. Thank you, boo. Appreciate that. Hey, hey, hey. Get it. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Can I do a video? What's up, girl? Hmm. Is this the period R, period L, girl? Hello. Oh, baby, I'm sorry. Uh, I mean, uh, I did that by mistake. You could drop me, baby. Oh. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck is she saying? She's like, hey, girl, up here, up here, up. Anyways, so anyways, y'all, let me hurry up and get to the point, y'all, real quick, real quick, real quick. So, anyway, so she asked because she bring the other girl up, right? And when she asked because she bring the other girl up, um, she, uh, Punk was like, as long as she can sign the NWA, it don't matter. So, the lady came up, and like I told you, both of them was on some weird shit. Kept telling me I was sexy, kept kissing me with one of the girls. The girl that was supposed to be there kissing me on the cheek and um, squeezing my jaws and shit. Just talking about, oh, you just a little pretty little thing, just all of that. And I'm just looking at like, and I'm like, girl, stop kissing me. Like, girl, you got you got herpes or something? Like, girl, like, I swear to God, I literally told her how I was. I'm like, stop kissing me. She's like, no, baby, I'm not gay. I'm not gay. She just kept saying that. I'm like, I didn't say you was gay. I said, stop kissing me. So, anyways, long story short, um, what ended up happening was now. Another bitch came. Huh? How all of a sudden Pucket kicked one bitch out and two girls left. Now two other bitches come, right? So boom. Pucket kicked the girl out because the girl was flirting with the cameraman. I'm going to just tell you that now. But anyway, so the other girl brought her friend up. Pucket was cool with that because she signed the NWA. But the girl said, oh, don't worry. I'm not going to be in the camera anyways or whatever. So then another girl came hungry, asking for fucking burritos and shit because they went to Chipotle. And uh, the one girl had an extra plate. Her name was uh, Miss Westside. I like Miss Westside, baby. She cool. So Miss Westside, baby, had Chipotle and she don't eat cheese. So she was like, Oh, you can have this, uh, cause she was like, uh, ain't no food up here. The girl came up there straight up, like, ain't no food up here. We like, first of all, bitch. And then Punk was like, you gonna sign the NWA? Me and Punk looked at each other though. This was when me and Punk was, you know, still like cool. So I mean, I looked at her like this damn this girl coming asking for food. She ain't even a part of shit. Punk was like, I know. So anyways, Punk went in the back. Me uh, and the other girls, we was chilling. So the cameraman started recording because me and one of the girls started doing dialogue. So he started recording when we started talking to shit. So me and the other girl was talking. She was like, damn, where's these other girls at? And I'm like, shit, I don't know. These bitches are second forever, but these bitches don't want it. They ain't got to get it. You know, we just talking. So the man started recording. And then he started, you know, started trying to record the whole room. So one of the girls was like, uh-uh, uh-uh, don't get me on camera. Don't get me on that camera. So he had to stop filming. So he stopped filming. And that's what I was looking like. And now I'm mad because we're finally getting some camera time.
<laughs> so I'm like, you know what? So I go in there. I just go tell Punk. I said, Punk, I was like, this is crazy. You know, um, he finally starting to record because I told y'all he wasn't recording shit. So like, he finally started recording, it, and and I'm like, now why that bitch, uh, that uh, old girl brought up? I don't record her. So Punk just go up there. I I lay in my bed because I'm like, at this point, I'm over it. I don't know whether we gonna record or not. So I'm laying in my bed. Punk go up there. And so the other ladies, they had to leave or something like that. She said, if y'all not part of the film, we just got to actually leave because it's a distraction. We don't need no distractions. That's what she claimed. She said, I didn't hear it because I laid in my bed. So then that's what uh one of the other girls came back there. She was like, damn. And I was like, what? She was like, shit, that one, uh, Punk was asking the girls to leave and they just snapped. So I went up there and I was like, what happened? Punk was like, oh, shit, that girl just cussed me out. And I said, she cussed you off what? She was like, uh. Talk about something you ain't got to tell me to leave and all of that. So that's when I was like, oh, I said, that's kind of fucked up, but it's cool. So then the girl that supposed to be there who brought them bitches came and sat down. So she was like, what happened? What's the problem? I said nothing. She said the girls cussed at her because she asked them to leave, which I don't know why they cussed at her. If this is her show, if she asked them to leave, it shouldn't be a problem. She's like, no, no, that didn't happen like that. She didn't. All she said was, if you want us to leave, we're going to leave and blah, blah, blah. So she started yelling, making it a big deal. Nobody else was yelling. She's like, nah, 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 it didn't happen like that. So I'm like, okay, girl, you ain't got to yell at me. So I told her to calm down. So that's what Punk was like, yeah, she did. And the other girl said, yeah, she did, she did say. She's like, you ain't got to tell us twice. And nah, 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 nah. So then the other girls came with her, both because both of them left to went to the bathroom, the ones, the two she asked to leave. So it's me, Punk, and the girl who brought them, and two other girls. We all sit at the table waiting on them two bitches to leave so we can start recording with no distractions. So that's when they start walking back. In the room, and I'm give me my shit, boy. Fuck is you touching my stuff, boy? Don't touch that to ass in my house. Damn. Mama, that was cool. It don't matter. It's not yours. Damn. Hey. Touch my fucking earpods. I ain't even get to use them yet. Then it's gonna be missing. Sorry. But anyways, so the girl yelling and stuff like that. Nah, it is that fucking serious because was he going to throw my shit in the toilet then what? Anyway, so, um, anyway, so, um, the girl, I was telling her to stop fucking yelling at me. I said, you ain't got to do all that motherfucking yelling, this and that and the third. And then that's when, as soon as the girls came in, I took off my shoes. It wasn't to fight. I took off my shoes because the dude started recording. Now, these are the shoes I wore. She wanted to be funny. These are the shoes I wore. These are Nike sandals, okay? And I'm stepping on the back of them. Yes, I am because that's how comfortable I like to wear my motherfucking shoes. Y'all, I understand. I told y'all we cool on the gift shop, but if y'all want to see me dollars up to the cash app y'all definitely can if y'all don't want to send no beans y'all please because y'all just do something to the live tap and share it something please um but um so i would doze comfortably through the house okay yes that's what i said comfortably through the house these are the actual shoes that i was wearing she's a cleats i don't give a fuck they still nikes bitch they still fucking Nikes with my jeans and my cute shit. And then, hold on, where my heels at? My heels is in my suitcase. I can't really get to them. My suitcase over there on the side of my bed. Thank y'all. So, and I had one pair of heels that I never really wore because we never really did any recording. Uh, it's Shy Cash birthday today too. Happy birthday, Shy Cash. So, anyways, so I took these off because the dude started recording. I took these off because I didn't want these on camera. Like, they shoes that, that I, just, just, that's comfortable, but that I don't want to be seen on camera with. So, I took them off. So, so, so what she did, Ivy, I'm learning not to care about people's words. No, I, it ain't about no words. I'm talking about the bitch tried to set me up. She tried to backdoor me. In Chicago, that means she smile on your face while somebody got a pew pew behind your head that she knows for to do it, and they pew pew your ass, and then they all leave and they act like they don't know what happened. That's what you call backdoor. Or like they caught, they started saying pop backdoor because of pop smoke, pop smoke. Thank you, thank you, SK. Thank you so much. Happy birthday, happy birthday, bro. Period. So what she did was 
she um she turned around and she um wait your birthday on the same day as my daughter's birthday i just thought about that hold up love you too Oh, yeah, don't ever let no hoe backdoor you, period. So you know what backdoor is. She tried to backdoor me. That's crazy, Shot, because I know. I saw a live with you last night. They shared your live in the Discord. E, thank you. Thank you. Oh, my God. Thank you, Dolores. Period. Thank you. Hold on. She probably told me my fair name. Maybe cut somebody else out on here. Yeah, it ain't got no uh, note on it. Thank you so much for the $50, boo. Thank you. Ivy before throwing herself off. No, nah, no, nah, I, I know where I'm at. No, nah, cause, cause they say her birthday shot cash. I just thought about it cause I remember last night it was his birthday. Like you know, I guess at twelve. Like you know, after twelve. So I guess he went live after twelve. But I was in his live for a little bit, and then I ended up uh, cause I was you know anyway. So then I'm like thinking about it, like, damn, it is today. Like you know, today his birthday is the same day as my daughter's birthday. So I never forget his birthday. Period. Shot cash. Period. Happy birthday. Yeah, at 12. Yeah, you were live at 12. That's what it was. Because I was like, damn, I thought it was yesterday. But I'm like, oh, it's today. But anyway, happy birthday, my nigga. How old you made? If you want to tell us, I probably could just click on your page and find out. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Damn, you young, nigga. Young as hell, 29. All right, period. No shade. Period, y'all. Shout out to SK. Period. If y'all want to, if he wants to, go ahead. You know, I don't care. 29, I see you a baby, nigga. Damn, five years older than you. God damn. Anyways, y'all, so I ain't throw myself off since if I remember where I was at. So, hold saying, shout out to Shawcast. I can't wait. Hopefully, is you coming to the Halloween party um next month? And if you are coming, what you coming as? Because you're know, on a Halloween costume party. I'm coming as Baby D. I got to go get me some puff balls. Period, y'all. Make sure y'all show up some love. And if they do see something, please say thank you. Okay, cool. I'll see you there, period. I'll see you there. All right, let me finish this story. Let me finish because this is this is, this is is how snakish uh, parking is. I told y'all some of y'all are ready. So, the girl, <coughs> I took off my shoes. This is how I know it was a setup. Because I took off my shoes. I didn't kick them off. It was getting rowdy. I just said, girl, you ain't got to yell at me. You know, we talking. And me and her been kissing on each other. Well, she been kissing on me all day. So me and her not really beefing. And she kept hugging me. And she kept talking about pium pium having pium pium. Talk about, ooh, do people want to see their brains outside their head and all of that. She kept saying that. And I kept cracking my jokes. I'm like, oh, bitch, uh, did you search her? I said, because I don't want to be sitting up here thinking it's safe and then beat a bitch up and get shot. I don't want to, I don't want to be doing that. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't trust that. I said, we on the third floor too. I said, it, it's not fair that she have a pium pium here. And she's like, I don't worry because security going to handle it. Security never came. Better get it started, period. I'm going to get a drink too, uh, shot cash. I'm going to get a drink too. And if you turn up, then I'll come over there. I'll fuck with you on your live. Um, and all of that. So anyways, um. As soon as I kicked out my shoes, the other two bitches walked in. Okay, I'm going to use this. They walked through the door. You see, they walking in, so they facing this way. So when they walking in, I'm facing this way, and the other girl is right here. So they walking in, I'm facing that way, and they right here. That's why you got to stay strapped. I, I know I'm finna get my pium pium, though. I, I already signed up. I'm finna go get my pium pium. I already signed up for my boy card, and I just got to go get my consent to carry. But I can get my pium pium as long as I got my Ford card. But the only thing is, I'm not going to be able to take it outside this house. So I'm going to get my consent to carry. I just scared to get the pium pium because of my son and my daughter at this point and my brother. I'm just scared. But I'm going to get it and I'm going to have it so it's nice. I can't talk about it right now because my son be listening. But I got it. I got it together. Next time I go, so I'm going to have my motherfucking shit on me, G. But the thing is, I got these. I don't be needing no pew pew. You feel me? Like, I fight fair. I don't believe in that. So anyway, so when Shorty kept talking, cracking jokes about the bullets and shit, she got mad because when dudes started filming, I said it. Because, bitch, if something happened to me where they're not recording, bitch, they going to know who had the pew pew. So I was like, ah, bitch, we start roasting each other. Remember I told you? We was roasting each other, and she got mad. This was before this incident. I'm going to get back to that. Hello? Yeah. Yeah, I did. Don't forget the three bottles of water. All right. Cranberry juice of cups. Because you know y'all threw all my cups away. All right. Yeah, my daughter, she got to drink some cranberry juice. They say, now, Ivy, 
You need one, but the laws out there. I told you they out here nuts, man. I'm not gonna be living out here too long, though. I wanna move to Atlanta. I'm gonna move out there with y'all. For real. I need to be around my friends. I'm moving out there with y'all. I'm just waiting on my daughter to graduate. She wanna graduate, so one more year I'm moving out there. I'm 42 and just bought my first pew pew. That's what I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared to have a pew pew. And the laws out here for to be even more crazy. Yes, I'm definitely moving out there. I'm moving to Atlanta. I told my daughter. And plus my daughter's stepdaughter out here. Yeah, I'm coming. Don't worry. I need y'all to help me though. Y'all gotta hook me up with some like you know, systems out there, like, let me know, like, so I can get it started, because I'm going to start saving up my money, uh, what's up, what's up, Trina, so anyway, so, the girl got mad, because when they, when they started filming, and, um, we was roasting each other, and she was like, ah, bitch, brah, and I was like, yeah, bitch, now, boom, 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 your ass, and she said, yeah, bitch, now, woo, woo, I said, what you gonna, woo, woo, you gonna pull out them bullets, them bullets, you said, she said, bitch, I ain't got no motherfucking bullets, got instantly real serious. She got serious. I'm like, yeah, bitch. I say, what you got to get mad at for? You the one said it. She's like, I know. I cracked the joke. I said it. This is how she talk. I'm talking exactly how she talk. She's like, I know I said it. I don't understand. I said it. But I ain't got no motherfucking bullets. I ain't got no motherfucking bullets. She's talking about the bullets. I ain't got no bullets. I ain't got no bullets. I told her I ain't got no bullets. That's why I think she do crack. Because crackheads talk like that. She talk with her. No, 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 no. I ain't got no bullets. I told you I got no bullets. Man, come on. She's talking about the bullets. Tell her about the bullets. Like, that's exactly how she talk. And I barely could understand what she said. But being that I talk fast, I kind of understood some of the shit she was saying. But that's how that bitch talk. So she got mad. That was that incident. That was just, you know. This motherfucker. Study fucking calling me. Hello. How much is it? All right, I'm going to say three more dollars. Damn, man, I can't even get through the shit. I already ain't got no fucking money to be playing with y'all. I don't know why it be declining. Why people cars decline. Oh, Dolores. I just sent the $3 to you. I just sent the $3 to you. Oh, my God, but thank you, though. Hold on. <laughs> See, distract me. Damn, I just sent the three dollars to Dolores. But anyways, look, that's how you, that's the, that's how you give back to the community. Um, <clears throat> um. So, anyways, um. Okay, so that was yesterday. We gonna act like yesterday. Um, we gonna act like yesterday was um the day that she did that. Now today is the day that. She brought the bitches in. I ended up kicking out my shoes. So the girls coming in like this. She's standing right here facing me. They coming in like this, but they not at me yet. So when she was talking to me and I kick out my shoes, as soon as I kick my shoes, she say, what you pulling up your shoes for? Then that's when one of the other girls got in the way. So I had to turn around and say, bitch, I said, first of all, I'm taking off my shoes because I can take off my shoes, bitch. I'm not taking off my shoes to fight you. I said, gee, if I wanted to fight you, I would have been swallowed. Gee, she's like, I'm not trying to fight you either. So what you mean? What you taking off your shoes for them? I said, gee, you better back the fuck up because she kept on trying like she was uh up. Uh. And by us, him, he, he was recording this shit. Now she getting real hype. So I said, girl, I don't give a fuck about none of that shit. Woo. And I pulled out my wig. Sure the fuck did. I said, now what's up? Now what's up, bitch? Now, now, now you got something to worry about. Fuck is you talking about? So then you got the other cousins coming in there. Uh-uh, uh-uh, what's this about? Look like they trying to run up on me. I said, what's up? I swear to God. On my mom. I did one of these numbers right here, bitch. I got, I got kind of nervous because I thought them hoes was going to jump me. So I swear to God, as soon as one of them, I said, what's up? What's up? What's up? I swear to God, I'm, I'm on all eight levels, bitch. I'm like, what's up? I'm talking to all them hoes. And I already had a vision. That I was going to end up snatching one of them bitches like this and putting her on the ground and then stealing off the other bitch and drop kicking the other bitch in her gut. Oh, my mama, what's up? So, so, so you see the glass right there, right? Okay. Could you get out of my room? Could you see how aggressive I am? I don't want. If you let me use your phone too. No, my phone is, no. How are you trying to? I just got you Robux and everything, bro. I spent a little bit of it. So, why don't you go continue to play with your Robux? Because, like, I, I need to make a video. Like, you have a tablet. Make a video on there. I even signed up your YouTube and everything. But you're going to sign. All right, man. I'm going to make you a deal. Here's what's going to happen. And I'm not even going to be kidding about. I'm not going to be kidding whatever when I talk about. So here's what I'm going to do. If you sign me in to, 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 uh, what is it called? Light and Lit or something you call it, messenger, all of that. I will leave you alone like, for a month. No, I'm not lying, man. I swear to God. Oh, so thank you, Dolores. Dolores said sent the three dollars back. So you want me to sign you up for like? You cannot get on there. That is for eighteen and up. Huh? 
18. You're not 18. 18 and up. 18 and older. You you have 11 oh, years. I still want to. I still want it. Mom. Hello. Hold on, hold on. Chuck, is he still downstairs? How long? He is, Mom. Okay, Cecil. This don't make no fucking sense, y'all. I can't even get through the fucking story. How long? And I'm losing my voice again. I need to stop yelling. <coughs> Give me one second, y'all. I need to hurry to bring my water. Who come, Chuck? I can hear his phone. Oh. He's asleep. Fucking sleep. Oh. Sister, come on, get out of my room, because you can go and stop. Hello? Hello? Hey, why your car keep it declining? Could you uh check your cash out? Hello? Yeah. I know, check it on your phone. Are you okay? I was just asleep. Okay, but why are you doing all that? Because Could you hurry up? Because he's at the store. Yeah. Look, you woke me up. Who the fuck told you to go to sleep? Hello. Yeah. I am kindly here and welcome to Baldi Dice. This is a Baldi's Basics mod by Baldi. It is a good And uh, it kind of speaks for itself. But Baldy will explain the rules. <laughs> I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm busy right now. Okay, would you? Yeah, if we get a question wrong, Baldy dies. And if I know my Baldy dies, What's up? There are questions that are impossible to answer. So basically... Why is, why is there ain't no money in here? I don't know. I ain't went nowhere. I'm right here. But Baldy will explain the rules for you very briefly. Don't be don't say you sent me anything. It don't. Go up to the right. To the sand. Where's your cash tag at? Right here. Go to me. Right here. Sorry, Baldy. You got a knife in your shoulder. Goodness gracious. Just don't go You only got one CA, right? Huh? One One cash out. Yeah. This shit is fucking beyond me. No right there. Okay. That's exactly what I sent it to. Hold on, let me see your phone for a second. What the fuck? Hold on. I know I did not send it to the wrong person. Just like I accidentally just said the Lord is the money. Hold on. Yeah. Damn. Damn, man. Who the fuck I just sent that money to? Who the fuck is this? 